from the beginning of mankind's history, it is always inspired by not only for needs, but for, from the inquisitiveness of human. And people have, from centuries, they have broke the boundaries, boundaries of our limited thoughts, boundaries of our limited acts. You know, five senses together, making the, all this Vedic lifestyle was also breaking up, breaking up boundaries once when people were still in the Stone Ages. So it is not a new thing, but, you know, breaking the boundaries brings a lot of acts, process, a lot of functions and products in another maybe 10 years or less, less than that. So let me tell you the story of something which 51 years I have lived with one instrument only, which is a slide guitar. And um, it inspired me to find all these, uh, all these days how to bring the potential activities of this instrument into a, a rise of the instrument from 16 slide guitar to 24 string Indian slide guitar. For that, to, uh, for that I had to do a lot of re-imagining of the design, reinstallations, uh, learning from my gurus have helped me to do a lot of, uh, lot of uh, brain work and uh, activities like, say, <clears throat> learning singing of the voice, just delivering the nuances of the expressions, how that can be collaborated into two hands activities. One hand, slide guitar is, you know, why it is called slide guitar? It is because this is the slide. You don't play like this. You just hold this bar, and one side is the bridge. It is 25 and half inch scale. You manipulate, maneuver your slide on top of it, and you change the pitch, and that pitch makes the melody, and the melody brings the expression. So it is called slide guitar. So for doing this, rethinking the design and, uh, but I should say where the Hawaiian guitar came from. Hawaiian guitar came from Hawaii in 1930s. 1929 actually, Tao Moi brought the Hawaiian music and with his band and lived in Kolkata before Second World War and during Second World War and little bit after Second World War, where he was playing and entertaining British and American officers, as well as affect. Sleepwalk. Famous Hawaiian guitarist by contemporary Bobby Ingano on slide guitar. Actually played that song also in a, in a Hollywood movie. Um, and then it has been played in Indian movies as well and uh, contemporary non-movie songs also. So um, that is an Indian version of uh, slide guitar playing. Video please.
You will know the name, Sunil Ganguly, the great. So this, this was till 1980s when slide guitar and film songs and non-film songs were very popular in India before Casio and uh, keyboard arrived from China and Japan. So this is a monotone instrument, slide guitar. You can only have one tone, like a voice. But uh, in my life, I started playing the slide guitar at the age of three. And uh, by age of four, I started picking up all the uh, Rabindra Shongi Tagore songs and uh, film songs, non-film contemporary songs, Adhunik Gan, we used to call, of Mannade, Lata Mangeshkar. Just like a fun, I enjoyed it so much. I just keep on, kept on playing, but at the same time, I was learning so singing from my parents. Kaha se yae piya bor, bor av. And I was looking at my parents and looking at their expression and sound and try, trying to mimic with my left hand on, the, on my slide guitar. That's how I have started picking up. But then at the age of 13 or 14, I found that Ravi Shankar the Sarod Maestro, how they have started affecting my soundscape overall. And I thought, my God, the 16 slide guitar is not enough to produce that kind of cultural sound of my country. So a uh, video of uh, Ustad Ali Akbar Khan, you just hear the sound of that instrument. <laughs> See that, that kind of bold, robust sound of the instrument. That affected me as a child artist. So I roam around the neighborhood to find luthier, existing luthier who can help me to bring a new structure of an instrument which can give much more powerful sound, much more sustenance like voice, much more resonance and timber to match the actual soundscape of Indian classical music, Indian traditional musical instrument culture here. So every country has a violin, piano, flute, and here Veena, Sitar, Saroda, Sarangi, all have a culture which we can only understand by not looking, by hearing. So that Shravan listening the soundscape is more important. So when we say slide guitar, then I just redesigned the ribs inside of the instrument, brought new wood and new structure, new length, new position of strings, added more strings. And then once the sound has been created, the soundscape has been generated, then was the question how to play. Because there is no reference of how to play, you cannot use the sitar or sarod technique on a slide guitar. So that technique I had to develop. And then I first, my instrument was made in 1978 when I was 15 years old. 
to make my first Chaturangi in Kolkata. And when you see a slide guitar, it's a six string and it is in a small box and six tuning pegs and is being played with a slide and finger pick. But that's the end of the similarity between my instrument and a Hawaiian slide guitar. And uh, so I started changing my finger picking and bar positions left hand and right hand. And I started bring the Indianness into the music by my technologies of both the hand sync. And in 1994, 1993, when I went to abroad first time, traveling with eminent musicians with Ustad Zakir Hussain, uh, Pandit Ullash Kashalkar, Pandit, late Pandit Buddhadev Das Gupta, the great Sarod Maestro, I started listening to the soundscape live. I, I, had, I had been uh, performing there. And I have also gathered those musicians around me and learned how more importantly, the Indian slide guitar have a potential so I am showing you the, my guitars. This is my Chaturangi. It's 24 stringed slide guitar. I will give you small, small demonstrations for next few minutes and um, of Indianness and the global quality of this instrument. Thank you so much. So the first thing is open six strings, which like Hawaiian guitar. first the basic sound of the instrument and then this is the signature sound of this instrument are just hearing the soundscape of this instrument. Now, the singing style of our country. You see the sustenance of this instrument is 
One octave, two octave in one strike. And then in addition, two strings on the front, it changed this instrument from all the slide guitars of the world. And then the resonating strings Now the rhythm accept rhythm format of this music European European music on Indian slide guitar Thank you.